Greetings, friends. Ah, uh, yes, money meals from refund scammers. Up until recently, my track record for reporting multiple money meals for scammers was mostly driven by my publisher's clearinghouse scam bait efforts. But then an idea hit our team. Chappie and I realized there was a way to actually up the game when it came to refund scammers, and it's paying off. The result? It is not uncommon for us to report a foreign money mule bank account, a domestic money mule bank account, and an occasional Hawala business, but also a domestic cash money mule account. That's three money mule reports per refund scammer, and I'm thrilled by it. On December 27, 2016, I published my first YouTube scam bait video, and ever since, I have embraced the role as an accomplice scam baiter. Back when I started six years ago, it was mostly tech support scammers, but today I cover more. In this video, we take on a scammer who resorts to some pretty bad acting, as usual, and features a stellar performance by the one and only Chappie Gray as we milk these suckers of their time and their resources, chipping away at their operation. Cheers! Are you crying? Um, don't cry. Mama, I don't have any option. Mama, it's okay. I'm not. Don't cry. You're gonna make me cry. Mama. How no, much like... amount did uh, it is showing you there? Well, forty thousand. If there's no decimal, but uh, I, I I meant to put a decimal. And and, ma'am, forty thousand. And what does it say? Congratulations, transfer completed. Yes, it does. Are you kidding? Are you kidding with me, ma'am? No, I'm not. Um, how could how could you how could you make such a big mistake here, ma'am? I'm sorry. Do you I want your screen back? No, it says transaction is in progress. Please wait or wait for a moment. Ma'am, what you have done? And honestly, in my, in my years, I've never seen this happen before. I don't know what happened. Do you need me to call my bank and maybe have them? Cancel the transaction? Ma'am, 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 ma'am. Ma'am, you don't have to call your bank, okay? Okay. Because I have made the personal transfer. I haven't made the business transfer. If your bank comes to know that you got $40,000 from a business company, they will going to deduct the business transaction fee on 15% on $40,000, which you have to pay it from your pocket. Um, we did take a look at your friend's uh, account, and they, th this number has never been associated with that account. Oh, really? I spoke to my manager. He looked at the 8300 form that's now almost three months delinquent to the IRS. We took a look at you trying to send a significant amount of money to somebody that uh, seems like you don't really know because you don't even have their phone number. So because of that, the secure, the um, fraudulent department is going to have to come down and take a look at this. And okay. that means I have to freeze your bank account oh my gosh, until next really? week. So your debit oh, card, oh, you and your husband, your debit cards, if you put them in an ATM, they'll be confiscated. I don't understand why I'm being charged. Miss, as I can check here, there is a charge of $349.99. Okay. So if um, you want to cancel that subscription, you have to be on the computer for cancel it. Okay. Uh, yes, I would like to cancel, please. And I am on my computer because I got it in my email. Okay. So I don't understand why. Okay. Can you be please on go to the computer. Google? Let me tell you, Miss, why you have to be on the computer. Macassi okay. Security is working for a computer security, which is protect your computer from the viruses. In every computer, security has a license key, and it is installed in your computer, in your IP address. That's why we have to cancel that license key. After that, um, you will get your refund back once we will cancel that subscription. Um, it's downloading now, the Now, look at the left side bottom. Yeah, downloaded. Yes. Um, do you see a file downloading? With the yes, I do. It says any desk period exe. I've been trying to tell you. 
under interactive access do you see never show the third one never show incoming session request yes i do click on the never show incoming session request okay all right mate now let me help you to cancel that subscription just give me a moment here okay now you can see that i'm typing over there i have opened that scan box do you see that black box on your screen yes i do with the help of this scan i'm going to cancel that license key which is running into your ip address this is your ip address and we are just going to removing that license key from your ip address after that i'm going to forward your case to our billing department for your refund so um, just give I, me a moment here may i ask where's your office location where are you based uh seattle washington miss oh seattle i love seattle that's a it's I never I was there when I was a little girl. That was but that was a long time ago. <laughs> I love I love Seattle. All right, miss. You are at your office right now? No, I'm at home. I I I saw the email this morning. Okay. And I said, "Okay, maybe I'll come back and call them during my lunch break." And that's what I'm doing. I'm sorry for that, miss. I'm just wasting your time. But we have to just cancel it so we I have to okay. do this thing. No, this is more important than me going to McDonald's or whatever. I can eat when I get back to work. They have a break room. You can you can eat at your home, miss. Well, if you wouldn't mind, could I go get a muffin and heat it up? I'd like to have a muffin at least. Yes, you can have it, miss. I'm on the okay. call with you. Okay, thank you very much. I'll be right back. Okay, now can you please tell me, Miss? You have to go anywhere? Like you have to? Do you have any appointment, or you have to go to your office? Um, in about um forty-five minutes, I have to go back to work. Now, Miss, what I'm gonna do here? I'm going to forward your case to our billing department. Okay. You will going to receiving a call back. Okay, so they're gonna call me back. Up, and what do you have to do? You have to leave that scan as it is. Do not close anything. You okay. when you receiving a call back, you can just close it out. Hello. Uh, yeah, hi, ma'am. A very good day to you. This is John, and I'm the senior refund officer here. How are you doing today? I'm doing good, John. How are you? I'm also fine, ma'am. Thank you for your concern. May I know, ma'am, what do you see on your screen right now? Um, it says interactive access. Um, permissions. Oh, really, oh, now I see the notepad. Accept. Accept. Do you see accept? No, I don't. Are you eating something? No. Sounds like you're eating. No, no. Okay. Okay, you can see interactive access out there, right? Yeah, it says interactive access and it has never show okay. incoming session. Okay, now. Right now, you will get the form on your screen, okay? Okay. How's your day going? It was pretty good, ma'am. And how was yours? And thank uh, you, ma'am. Thank you very much for asking me this you bet. thing, ma'am. I appreciate it. Because, you know, uh, many of the... I talk to uh, lots of customers every day. Oh, but I bet. none of them were asking me about how I'm doing today. But oh, well, I got your just... point from you. Yeah, that's that's, just, that's just something that's always you know, good to say when you're when you're talking huh. to someone. It makes them feel like they're like they're important. You know exactly. I just want you to please go ahead and just first of all let me secure the connection. Okay. I just want you to please go ahead and write down the balance what you have in your checking account at this moment, now Because okay. once I will initiate your refund. You can make a differentiate between it that you have got the refund. Okay, so I'm writing so down just my. Just make a note of your balance. Okay. Yes, sure. Your refund is uh four fourteen point ninety nine. Is it right? That's correct. Right now, I'm gonna go ahead and start the transfer. That was the reason. Okay, we are making your refund into two parts. Okay, first sending you for it, and then we will send you forty. Dollar point ninety nine cents. Okay, that's kind of interesting. Why do you have to do it in two parts? Let me explain you. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm just making the transfer. 
Okay. Um, I'm going to put the phone down. I need to use the restroom. Would that be okay? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. If I need you, I'll let you know. But you, you do me a favor. Keep your phone with on your on your hand because okay. I need to ask you something right I'm now. Not I, am like, not take I am not taking the phone into the restroom with me. What are you thinking? Why would I take... Okay. Why would I why would I take the phone into the restroom with me to go to the bathroom? Sorry, I, because I was just making the transfer. I didn't hear you properly. That was the reason. That's okay. okay. No that's problem. Okay. What a dumb dummy. I mean, gee, that's the this... <laughs> Listen to me very carefully, okay? I am in a very very last step of transferring you the refund. It is asking in my online banking map that how does your receiver, its mean you, would like to receive the money, okay? Whether you would like to receive it, we have two types of transfer. The okay. first, personal, and the second is business. If you will going to receive the money from us in a personal way, ma'am, then you don't have to pay any kinds of taxes to your Cyprus Credit Union. And if you will get this money from us in a business way, then you have to pay 15% of the taxes from the amount which you will want to get from us to your bank. So okay, just well, let me know in which way you would like to receive the refund. Personal I mean, or a business? I would prefer personal. I don't want right to I, I don't wanna pay taxes. My brother has personal. Okay, okay, no, no problem, no problem. Do you see welcome to Chase Bank? Um, yes, I do. Put down the name of your bank. Okay. And ma'am, this is the very secure form of our bank. Don't make any mistake here, please. Okay, I'll try not. Well, I usually don't, but I'll try not to. Now listen, you need to put down your refund amount here. No dollar sign here. Okay. Four zero zero dot zero zero. It's not letting me type. I can't type. I tried to put the decimal and it didn't do a decimal. What? I typed four zero zero dot zero zero, but the decimal didn't didn't show up. So I don't know what it, why. The decimal hasn't been showed up. No, How much like, amount did it, uh, it is showing you there? Well. Forty thousand. If there's no decimal, but uh, I, I I meant to put a decimal. And and ma'am, forty thousand. And what does it say? Congratulations, transfer completed. Yes, it does. Are you kidding? Are you kidding with me, ma'am? No, I'm not. Um, how could how could you how could you make such a big mistake here, ma'am? I told you while you're. Can you please do me a favor? Check your account now. Oh my God. Holy okay. shit. What you did, ma'am? What 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 I did? I typed four zero zero dot zero zero and it didn't take it. So I don't know what's wrong. It it didn't let me type a period. I could be in a trouble, ma'am, because of your mistake. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry, I didn't know. Oh God. Oh God. Uh, How could starting... you make such a mistake? It could be a nightmare for me, ma'am. I'm sorry. Do you I want try... your screen back? No, it says transaction is in progress. Please wait or wait for a moment. Wow. What you have done. And honestly, in my, in my years, I've never seen this happen before. I don't know what happened. Do you need me to call my bank and maybe have them cancel the transaction? Ma'am, 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 ma'am. Ma'am, you don't have to call your bank, okay? Okay. <laughs> I have made the personal transfer. I haven't made the business transfer. If your bank comes to know that you got $40,000 from a business company, they will going to deduct the business transaction fee on 15% on $40,000, which you have to pay it from your pocket. Well, no, I can call them and can say... Can you please I tell me, to... can you please... Listen, I... listen, you don't need to call them up. Can you please tell me exactly what happened when you were putting down the refund amount there? I typed four zero zero period zero zero, and the period wasn't working. I got your point. I got your point. Your dot hasn't been appears there, and because of a single dot, 
there was a mistake occurred over there instead of getting 400 you got forty thousand dollars from our companies into your account and you right. got it in a personal way now if you will call the bank if your bank comes to know that you bought the money from a business company forty thousand dollar in your account thing what they will gonna do they will gonna deduct the business transaction fee which you have to pay it from your pocket okay um, my god could you well, please do me a favor just you, wait for, on a line you, you told me well, you told you told me you did it as a personal transaction so how about i go to my bank and say that i need to cancel a personal transaction no no you don't need to do that okay that's what's the reason just be on a line let me okay, call okay. my receptionist and ask her what we have to do now, okay? Your receptionist? Okay. So do not log into your bank from any other devices. It may occur problem again and again. We don't okay. want it because this is the very first time I have been facing this kind of problem, ma'am. Anyone comes to know about this mistake, they will gonna think that I'm doing this intentionally because this is the first time I've been facing this kind of problem in my life. Yeah, I'm sorry. I am sorry. I, I didn't. Ma'am, ma I, mean I know that. Look, listen, listen. I know you haven't mean to do this, okay? I know we are human beings, ma'am. We can make mistakes. I know that. But what I want you to do, just be on a well, line. Keep patient. Let me speak to that's my what, receptionist. Let, that's, that's let why me I like, get the solution. Okay, okay. I can wait. And ma'am, tell me one thing. How far is the bank from your home? Um. It's not so much. It's about 30 minutes to the north, but my work is is to the south, so I'm going to be going in the opposite direction of my bank. But ma'am, look, there is no way you have to visit up to your bank to yes, fix this problem, to help I have, you, okay? So I, 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 have, I have to return to work. If I don't, I can lose my job. Ma'am, you're thinking, what are you saying, ma'am? Because apart from you, nobody can help me up. So if you are thinking about your job, I would be losing my job and I could be behind the bus. You, Think look, about me, ma'am, please. Look, you don't want to be drinking at a bar when you have this kind of pressure. It'll be much harder on you. Don't, don't go to a bar. I, on the other hand, have to go back to my job. I want you to know that I have great concern here and I am compelled to send this money back to you. I'm not going to give up on you, but I do have to return okay. to my job. I know that, ma'am. You will do it as soon as possible, okay? Do me a favor, okay? Let me calculate first that how much money you have to reverse me back. Okay. You got 40000 and your refund was 141.99. Right. So, so you have to return me thirty-nine thousand five eighty-five. Um, I get off work today at four p.m. Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. That's no, li no, listen. No, listen. I'm, I'm not finished. My bank. At what time you are? Uh, at, my bank. Listen. My, my bank closes at six p.m. So when I get off work, I will have two hours. I will have two hours to take care of this. I, You're in Seattle. You're in Seattle. It will be it will be three o'clock p.m. when I get off work. That's plenty of time. That is plenty of time to take care of this. Look, this is the very huge money which you got into your account, uh, and you I, can't return me the money, the check, I, and that and that. You have to make the wire transfer and listen to me. Right. And how the wire transfer works? Wire transfer works before the banking hour, which means before the lunch time. Okay, if no, you will doesn't. make the wire today, listen, I know it's... that, ma'am. We we know that. If you will make the wire before twelve, honey, then I I'm gonna... I I am out of time. I need to go back to work. I'm putting the computer to sleep like I have to. It's a, it's the rules in my apartment, and I'm going back to my car, and I have to return to work. When I get off work, do you want me to call you at the number you just called me from? Are you crying? Um, don't cry. I don't have any option. Mom, okay. I'm not... Don't cry. You're going to make me cry. Mom, 
it will take for you just 10 minutes at your bank you can easily make the wire and you can look, go for your work if but i don't if i to me, i am ma bound I, I i'm a nurse if i don't show up back from lunch a person could die that's what i do i work for a hospital are you sure you're gonna call me i need to give you the information in which bank you have to make the wire okay i haven't talked to my receptionist yet so i want you to please keep this thing with yourself okay of course as a as a secret uh, between you and me because listen to me why i am telling you man okay because you know i'm in a very tough situation i cannot explain you the situation the feeling how i am feeling right now man. okay i'm telling I, you I, everything honestly honey honey i i know and i i can tell you right now you're a man of fine character and you're talking to a woman with not only fine character but strong conviction i will return this money to you if it's the last thing i do on this good green earth okay i just need to go okay, back so to no the problem. hospital I, I, there are sick people up, there, are, there are sick people at the hospital i'm responsible for i need to take care of them okay okay i understand that i just trust on you man i should get a call from you at four o'clock or else i'm gonna call you at four o'clock yes ma'am can you hear me now hi yes okay i thought maybe you weren't gonna answer the phone I went no back no inside. all right ma'am like look uh the, what is so, the time in your place right now it's four, it's just now turning 4 p.m okay so i am ready to leave i'm gonna go back out to my car but and... but listen listen i am telling you one thing ma'am okay right now i had a word with my receptionist she told me if you will, will make the wire right now, that would be useless, okay? Because oh, you know the reason why? Because the banking hour are going to be closed soon. I know, and but the you, wire time... you, need, you need to understand, tomorrow I'm going to be going out of town on a nurse's retreat. Listen to me, listen to me. Tomorrow... You need to go at the first time. Did you not like hear me? Did you not hear me? If I go tomorrow, if I go there now and set up the wire, it would be the same as if I go tomorrow and do the wire. Tomorrow, though, at 6 a.m., I am getting on a plane to go to New York City oh. to meet at a convention, and then I'm going on vacation. I will be gone for three months. So it's okay, now or okay, never. Okay, okay. You have to keep in your mind that you have to make the wire in a personal way, okay? That Not in plan. business thing attached. That, that's the plan. That's what we've been talking about. Okay, so I'm sending you the account information right okay. now into okay. your text message. When you will go to the bank to make the wire transfer, okay, the bank will going to ask you to whom you are sending the money why you are sending the money this and that okay so i will explain right. you what you have to do okay i'm i'm driving right now i'm going to set the phone on the on the seat and that way i can drive properly um if you need me yes, just sure. holler just holler i'll hear you through the speaker phone takes about 20 to 30 minutes to get to the bank from here are you feeling okay i know you were worried about me about me getting this money back to you are you I'm okay? feeling okay, ma'am. That's good. Cause I am you were, okay, ma'am. Because you were, you were crying and you broke my heart. I started to cry. No. No, because look why I was, you know, it, it's been a uh, very long time. You are saying me that I will going to do it after some time. I was afraid whether you will going to do it or not. Because the thing is that, ma'am, I have been facing this kind of problem the first time in my life that's why i was a bit nervous at that point i imagine so you're in good hands i want you to know that i'm, I'm an honest person once you reach the bank parking lot first talk to me then go inside okay honey okay yeah do you see the account information yes uh, i have the chase bank and that is a business bank right. so the bank will gonna ask you 
to whom you are sending the money and for what reason you are sending the money. So what do you want to say then, ma'am? Well, our original plan was for me to tell them it's a person, personal, but now that it's a business, I'm not sure what to say. I'm going to explain you right now, okay? Just one moment, please. Just tell them, uh, like, it is a wood company. It is my friend company, all right? And I'm investing the money in this company. That's why I'm sending this money, okay? Okay, okay. No, I can, I, I can see what you're saying. All right. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead. It? Yes, and, I'm going to go. Yeah, and do not, do, not hang up the, do not hang up the line. I Keep won't. me on a line. I will be on mute. Okay. I will listen to you what you are going to do on the bank and wish you a good luck ma'am and god bless you and please make the wire ma'am for me i do my I'm best totally... i do my yeah. best okay. hello i need to make a wire transfer okay how much are you trying to send today um i'm sending um $39,585 oh okay let's let's just do it in my cubicle over here we have to fill out a couple forms. Do you um, do you have a license and debit card? Yes, I do. And here you are, my Utah driver's license and my um, bank bank debit card. Okay. All right. Let me just verify that you have this in your account. What is where's the money going? I'm just trying to read the next question down. What are you doing with the money? Um, this is me um, helping out a friend. Um, they run a business. Um, I'm helping them out. And it's it's a kind of a partial payment, possible investment. So you're you're loaning them this, or you're investing? It's more of an investment. I oh, I need the phone number for your friend that you're investing with. Oh wait a second, um, I don't seem to have that handy. Um, I need to make a phone call. You mind if I step out and get that phone number? Yeah, you can step out. I need to talk to my manager too. What wonderful, honey? Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay. Um, uh, they want they, they want a number. I can hear that. Yeah. I, I, do you have a number I can give them? Yeah, I'm giving you my number. And okay. ma'am, uh, just just you need to pressure them. Like I know to whom I'm sending the money. You don't have to take care of this. All right. You need to pressure them. I know to whom I'm sending the money. You don't need to take care of it. You just make the wire as I'm saying it to you. Well, I just, just need you to be. I, it's, I just need you to be aware if you aren't already. The information yeah, I'm yeah. giving... I, I'm, it, I'm it, sending it, you to my number. Okay. If they call the number and it doesn't verify, I can be convicted of perjury. That's what I'm trying to tell you. No, no. I, I will... You know, once they call me right now, I will verify it. I, um, I have the number. I was able to get okay. it for you. I, one second. While you were gone, I got uh, this other system up where I'm looking at your bank account. Uh -huh. There, there's a couple red flags on your account. Um, red flag. It looks like. Did your husband come down and withdraw a hundred thousand dollars cash? Um. Yes, that was about three, two to three months ago. Um. Okay. So what's going on is when your husband withdrew that money, he f he did not fill out the entire form, the eighty three hundred form. We've been trying to reach you guys for, it looks like, two and a half months. For him to have done that, take out $100,000 and then not respond to any certified letters, to any phone calls that we've sent in, is looking a little funny. Oh, my. Oh, goodness. Um, I wish he was here to answer to that. All right. Let me, I'm sorry to do this. I need to step out for one minute. I just need to verify this address with his bank. Okay. I, I, I mean, I verified the phone number. I'll be right okay. back. Okay. Thank you very much. Um. There's a couple issues here. I was just talking to my manager out there um, just because of your account and the 8300 not being filled out properly. And I just let him know that you're here in the building. Th this number has never been associated with that account. Oh, really? Yeah, we can okay, verify well, it right with the bank. And when you set up an account, you have to give a phone number. That's one of our verification processes. This is not tied to this account. I spoke to my manager. He looked at the 8300 form that's now almost three months delinquent to the IRS. We took a look at you trying to send a significant amount of money to somebody that it seems like you don't really know because you don't even have their phone number. Fraudulent department is going to have to come down and take a look at this. 
And okay. that means I have to freeze your bank account. Oh my God. Until next really? week. So your debit oh, card, oh, you and your husband, your debit cards, if you put them in an ATM, they'll be confiscated. Oh no. Really? I mean, come on. You can't allow me to just say. Not, no. Nope. Not, not do this at all. And then we can just be back to where I was or. I'll have a word with him tonight when he gets home. I'm sure you're doing your job. I, I, I understand. Are you there? I'm here, ma'am. I'm here. I don't know if you heard it, but I, 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 I heard that. I heard that. And do you have a Bitcoin account or what? No, we've since we, we are never going to do Bitcoin ever again because we lost twenty thousand dollars. Your husband withdraw hundred and thousand dollar from the account, and he didn't fill out any form. Well, and then it didn't help. The number you gave me, they look up the bank. See, banks can talk to each other. They looked up that number on the on Chase, and it didn't cross reference. So that combined with what my husband did, they're I, gonna I audit got the my point. account. I got the point. Since I do have I do have cash in my safe, what if I go? and purchase U.S. money orders. No, no, you have a cash in your safe. You can do me a favor, okay? I will you let what? you know what you have to do, okay? okay. How much do you have it? I have, I have about $90,000 $90, in the safe. Okay, so I, you I need, can do me a favor. I, I need to Tell go me back one thing, ma'am. Okay, no problem. You don't need to do anything. First, you do me a favor. Drive back to your home first, okay? Drive yeah, back to I'm your doing. home first. You need to send the cash to my financial manager address, okay? Oh, okay. I, I was able to pull out 40000 and then I just need to... They come in these $10,000 stacks, and then I just need to pull yeah, out... Yeah, $10,000 stacks. So you do me a favor, you gather four of them, right? So uh, first... I have four stacks, and then I need Rip, to pull out. First, I need to. I need to pull out four hundred. Yeah. First, five, you take out no, no not four hundred. Take out seven hundred from it. All right. Take out not seven. Eight, eight hundred, eight hundred from it. Okay. Okay. That's because, because five hundred dollar was your refund, and three hundred dollar, which UPS will gonna charge you. Okay. So take out. Eight hundred dollar from it. Okay, I just did. First, wrap the all that cash in a with a foil paper properly. Okay, do it three to four to five times. Wrap it all of them. Okay. After doing that, wrap it with the cello tape. How are you feeling? You feel okay? Yeah, I'm feeling okay. Cause you were crying earlier. I don't want you to get no worried. No problem, man. No problem. So I'm going to explain you right now. Okay. Listen, do you have a magazine? A magazine mm -hmm. or a book? Yes, I have. Um, the books I have, well, the, the stack of cash wrapped in all this foil won't fit in a box. Yeah, find the box which will be fit in the box, okay? I have a box. That will find fit. a book. Find a, find a book which will be fit in the box properly, okay? You put the cash in the middle of the book, all right? Okay. Okay. And then wrap the book with the cello tape, okay? Okay. okay. The pity heart and the shaming eyes is the name of the book. Okay. No problem, ma'am. You don't have to think much about it, okay? These were Do good books. Do as I say. These were good books. And ma'am, 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 can you do me a favor? Can you what? take a picture of the cash which you pack which you pack it, okay? Because that would be a proof, all right? So that I can show to my higher authority. Well it's wrapped in the box because I've already started wrapping it in the book. Oh. Do you have any spare clothes or a spare book at your home? I just used two books. I'm not using clothes. That's crazy. No, no. Because why I'm telling you when you will put the book on the box, all right, uh, when somebody will try to check the uh, check what is inside the box, if it, if it is make noise, then it could be a problem. That's why I'm telling you, you can put all the spare clothes 
or a toy if you have it in your home in the box so that honey, it won't make noise. Honey, there's maybe a space of, of an inch around the money on the side of the box. I think paper would be better. Newspaper. Whatever seems to you better, do it in that way so right. that the UPS won't come to know that inside the box there is money. And pack the box very properly, okay, so that no one can open the package if somebody try to do so. Please. The UPS store that I normally go to closes at, at about 6 I'm telling you, I'm telling you, closes the, the store which you have to visit. I checked all of that store, okay? But it, I can see on the uh, GPS, it is showing me 1.1 miles away from your home. Right, but you can't use that as a guide because I live in a suburb. I have to go up and around to get up. It takes about 10 minutes to get there. Yeah, take a picture of the box and send it to my receptionist number, okay? And ma'am, uh, can you do me a favor? Okay, you use you have one box. Can you put that box in on another box and then put some spare thing and then pack it? That would be fine. Okay, any uh, clothes? Use the double box. All right, for the safety. Uh -huh. That was the reason. I can get another box when I get to that. When I get there, they can do that and they'll pack it. They won't ask me what's in it, so no worries about that. I know that. I know that. The, I'm. The I just wanna go the, safe side. The longer, That's why. the longer we do this, the more likely they'll be closed. We better get going. And ma'am, the box which you are using it, make sure all the four sides of the box are covered. It's, yeah, okay. I got the my. I'm, I'm. Did you send the picture? I just sent you sent the picture to your receptionist. If I put more tape on Let this, me call my reception. If I put more... Let me check it. Listen. If I yeah, put, yeah, put put more tape on no, it. Put listen, more tape on it. All. Listen to me. If I put more tape on it, they're going to get suspicious. I need to make it look normal. Okay, ma'am. Check the uh, downside of the box. There is no tape on it, okay? It doesn't need it. It's, it's, a, it's a sealed box. If you overdo it, UPS won't take it. Yeah, yeah, I got it. I got it. We need to be discreet. I don't. I, I haven't. I, I've sent UPS boxes. They won't take it if it looks like a like a ball of tape. Don't be an idiot. Oh, I'm okay. No problem. If it seems okay, then no problem. I just want a good safe side. It looks completely safe to me. Are you planning to text the address to me? Yeah, 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 I'm, I'm doing so, okay? So once you reach, once you get to the UPS, you need to ask them for, for a box, UPS box, then you need to put that this box on the UPS box, then hand over to them, okay? Now you do me a favor, you just uh, leave your home for the UPS. Okay. By that time, I'm going to get the information Okay. From my receptionist, and I'm going to text you up in your message, okay? Okay. Did, did you say something? Yeah, I send you the UPS information on your message, okay? Okay, I, okay, yeah, I can see that. Once you, wonderful. Once you, re once you, listen, once you reach the UPS parking lot, first talk to me, okay? Okay, folks, got a third meal. This is a domestic cash meal. Okay, so I did have a, a, another question. Uh, basically, the... Um, oh, wait, hold on. Oh, I'm getting something important on my phone. What is this? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my... It's what my, it's my, mo it's my mother. Oh, my God. My mother, she's being rushed to the emergency room. She fell and broke something in the retirement. Oh my God, I gotta get there quickly. John, I gotta turn this car around. I gotta get to Midvale, the hospital. They're taking her into ICU. Oh my gosh, she's 87 years old. I'm gonna have to call you as soon as I find out what's going on. What happened? My mother fell in the retirement home and they've 
rushed her to the emergency room at Midville Central. Oh my God. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm uh, going straight there, and once I find out what's happening, I, I'll call you, okay? Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Ma'am, ma'am. UPS is just near you. You can complete the UPS, and you can go for her. No, she this would is, be safe. This okay? is my mother. I may not see her. She might die. I can't bear the, light, the thought of her dying before I can see her. I will call you as soon as I know what's going on, okay?